Hey gang, Scott Davenport here. A few days ago, I posted a video for removing power lines in Amon Photo Raw. I showed this divide and conquer technique to segment the lines into more manageable pieces so you can get cleaner results. Several people asked, is there uh, this option that Photoshop has for drawing a straight line? You're doing a shift click to get a straight line from one end of the power line to the other. I didn't think that existed in On One, and I was wrong. A uh, special thanks to Deshaun for actually trying this out and saying, you know, hey, Scott, this feature is here. And so I want to show that to you and uh, make sure you've got this as part of your toolkit. This is the same photo that I worked on in the previous video. And let's zoom in, and you can see I've already done some segmenting on these power lines right in here. I'm actually going to do a Command or Control plus and zoom in really close so we can see what's going on. So I've done the divide and conquer technique as showed in the other video. Check that out if you want to see the details on how to get your power lines into manageable segments. And now with the perfect eraser set, uh, what I was doing before is clicking here and kind of dragging along the power line. And you can see, you know, as I drag across, you, know, you get kind of wobbly. The tool will still do a good retouch, but you know, you can waver and maybe have to backtrack and so forth to get the result that you want. Instead, what we can do is I'm going to click once on the left edge here, and that'll take a moment. Really won't do a great retouch because you know you're trying to remove at the end of a line. It's going to replace it with more line. But now, over here, pressing down the Shift key, click. I get a straight line from point A to point B, and it erases that segment. So this becomes a much, much faster workflow to get rid of these segments, right? Click, shift click, and so on down the line for as many segments as you need to replace. So that's the bonus tip. Again, thanks to Sean for actually trying this out and not just dismissing it offhand as, oh yeah, we don't think it's there. So this is really cool. And I'm, I'm glad that uh, I learned something new about retouching in On One. And uh, yeah, that's going to do it for the video. Hope you've enjoyed it. If you did, let me know somehow in the comments. Got questions about photography? You know the drill at this point, right? And until next time, my name's Scott Davenport and happy shooting.